Hello, this is Mary Dubler, and this is another in our series on plants, trees, and flowers of the Bible. Our topic today is the almond tree, which grows primarily in Mediterranean-type climates, where the winters are mild and wet, and the summers are warm and dry. Almond trees grow to a height of 12 to 20 feet and take about six years to fully mature in fruit production. The trees produce fruit for as long as 30 years. Almond flowers are white to pink in color and appear long before the leaves. The fruit has a green outer hull that encloses a hard shell that contains the edible seed or kernel. The almonds are ready to harvest when the outer husk has dried and split. In the Middle East, almond trees typically flower in February and the almonds are harvested in August. About 60% of the world's almond crop is produced in California. Other leading producers are Spain, Australia, and Iran. Almonds are high in protein and are enjoyed in many foods, especially desserts, and are also used to make butter, oil, milk, and flour. Reading now from Jeremiah chapter 1, starting in verse 11. Then the Lord said to me, Look, Jeremiah, what do you see? And I replied, I see a branch from an almond tree. And the Lord said, That's right, and it means that I am watching, and I will certainly carry out all my plans. The Hebrew word for almond is very similar to the Hebrew word for watching. So the almond tree represents God's watchfulness over his people and his promise to fulfill his word in the lives of men and nations. God is a promise keeper, and one of my favorites is found in Matthew chapter 28, verse 20. Jesus says, And be sure of this, I am with you always, even to the end of the age. The Lord Jesus is not only watching over his people, he is also with them every minute of every day and giving them strength, peace, and grace. I am so thankful that I can trust God to keep his promises. Almond flowers are a great reminder of that truth. This is Mary Dubler, and I hope you've enjoyed learning about almond trees. Please watch others of our videos in this series regarding plants, trees, and flowers of the Bible.